So, um, I'm going to talk to you a little bit about um, the forcing of height we've been doing on the uh, before. But just before that, a uh, few words about uh, the status of the um, two uh, project I mentored. But last year I uh, watched over um, uh, Mike Smith, who uh, um, finished what I started with the virtual box yesterday. So, uh, well, uh, basically it, it's not totally finished yet, but uh, there's big news. The, uh, the source code has been integrated into the VirtualBox uh, uh, SVN, so uh, it's now uh, official. Uh, there are not uh, built and shipped yet with VirtualBox, but well. Uh, and there are still some issues like uh, it's not yet uh, built with GCC2, uh, so it's of limited use to, uh, to uh, Average people, but uh, still, it's uh, not too bad. Uh, there, I have uh, an old version, uh, but well, you can see uh, uh, the shared folders uh, actually mount. Uh, although it seems to lock up when I try to play it, but at least you can uh, see what's uh, in there. And then um, this year, um, uh, I had uh, another student, uh, Pavel, who, who um, um, wrote uh, uh, NFS4 uh, client. Uh, yeah. um, and because we did have um, uh, we did have NFS, but it was an um, antique um, BOS stuff that I ported to Haiku, but it was. NFS2 and uh, and it was uh, quite crash prone, um, so uh, uh, he wrote it from from scratch, uh, and it works not too bad. There are still some bug, bugs, uh, but uh, well, um, uh, yesterday he sent me a mail and he's uh, he's back on the on, on business, so uh, we we'll see some actually he did some new commits on it, uh, so that's the latest uh, version I have here. Um, uh, okay, you install. Um, I hope I have the binary. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Uh, But it did work. 
so well, we'll get a new uh, network file system quite soon. Um, it's still in uh, his Git branch, but uh, I suppose we should probably uh, be able to merge it uh, to Trunk uh, quite soon. Uh, okay, let me come to work. All right. So that was for the um, color of cut stuff. Uh, and then, um, well, I started Haiku Post for various hardware already. Uh, and then someone uh, asked me several times, oh, I've got this uh, uh, Amiga board here, uh, and it would be nice to have Haiku in it. And I said, well, uh, I can do it. Um, <coughs> so he gave me the board. It's this um, Sun Forces O uh, board from IQ. It's actually one of the systems that are sold as new Amigas uh, to run Amiga OS. Uh, it's, uh, it's quite interesting. Um, it's an embedded kind of board, uh, so it, it can also run Linux to do embedded stuff. Uh, it's using a system on chip uh, processor. It has PCI Express, uh, SATA cores, and well, almost everything required for the desktop. Uh, however, unlike um, most uh, PowerPC platforms and all those that we supported for, for now, it uses U-Boot as firmware. So we already had U-Boot uh, support in, uh, uh, in Haiku. I, I wrote it uh, already, but it was for ARM. Uh, so I had to clean this up uh, to separate the uh, architecture specific from the U-Boot generic code. Um, and then, well, uh, it also has an ROS port now. Uh, then it was quite uh, easy for them because they don't have to uh, deal that much with the uh, MMU. They just uh, map everything at boot and they are done with it. So it's a bit uh, cheating. Um, I also wanted to be able to uh, test stuff in QMU uh, because it's um, much easier uh, usually. Uh, but uh, well, they didn't, uh, we didn't have a, a target that was even close to it, so I started writing one. Uh, the uh, CPU is not fully emulated, but uh, well, enough to, uh, to, to do something. Um, but the other uh, similar targets, uh, they only support uh, loading the kernel directly and uh, running it without uh, much of the hardware the uh, firmware is actually supposed to initialize. So, um, so I couldn't really start from them. Um, well, I started from them, but I had to add lots more to uh, just get uh, U-Boot started. Because I wanted to see how you would uh, uh, Works on, on, on this hardware. So for now, it starts a uh, high loader um, uh, as a Linux kernel, and it can also uh, start the uh, official UBoot image, but it doesn't go very far. It, it panics when it tries to enumerate the uh, the uh, memory uh, teams uh, because it, it's missing some hardware. Uh, 